everyone my name is Crystal and today I'm going to be showing you how to make one of these a small candle using wax and crayons for this project you will need wax I have chose soy wax flakes um, you'll need a microwave safe container I've chose a glass um, measuring cup a candle holder your scent if you choose one and your candle wick your crayons for color and as a safety precaution an oven mitt because this can get really hot really quick in the microwave okay everyone the first thing that you want to do is dip out a little of your soy wax or whatever wax source that you're choosing and put it in your microwave safe container along with your color of choice for your crayon I'm gonna go with this shade of blue move everything else out of the way open your door to your microwave and we're going to set that in the microwave and covered and put it on two minutes Okay, with our oven mitt, we're going to reach into the microwave and pull out our wax. Usually, it's not going to be 100% melted the first go round, so we'll pull it out with our oven mitt, of course, because trust me, you don't want to touch it. Uh, use your little a little popsicle stick. I have one here lying around from the last candle that I did. Give it a little stir. This one actually went all the way down the first go around. I'm choosing not to add a scent to this one. It's just going to be for pretty looks. So, again, with the oven mitt, put, actually, we will dip your wax clip into this and then let it solidify in the bottom of your jar. Now I have this little neat little gizmo here to help keep my whack or my wick centered um, and you can see in there that it's starting to solidify that's just going to help it stick to the bottom of the glass so that way when it starts to melt it won't go anywhere. So like I was saying with your mitt I don't know mine's a little bit dirty. It's just it's been in a couple accidents. So we will move everything over to get to our container. So that we get caught with the mitt on. Probably should have thought about that before, but hey, I'm human. Um we're going to pour this in. And we're going to let that cool sometimes this process takes anywhere from 30 to 45 minutes just wait till it fully solidifies before adding your next layer if that's what you're wanting to do also a quick cleanup tip grab a designated rag that you don't care to get dirty because it's gonna stay dirty while this is still liquid clean it out otherwise you will have a big yucky mess Okay, so basically now we're just going to repeat the process. So again, fill your microwave safe container with wax and the color of your choice. Stick it in your microwave for two minutes until it's fully melted. Again, use your little popsicle stick to stir it, make sure there's no leftover wax in there. And then set it to two minutes and wait. Alright, so I took it out of the microwave. You can see my color is yellow now. Um, you can also see that there are a few little bits of wax and crayons still floating around in there. So we're going to give it uh, probably about another 30-45 seconds. 
again with your oven mitt because glass gets hot. Alright, so now it's fully melted. Repeating the steps of pouring it in. And now wait till this layer is dry before adding your other layer and so on and so forth. All right, so I have the final layer going, which is, I'm not really sure exactly what color it is. Open the door. There's the candle now. Um, you can see that it's not melted. So we're just going to take our stick and stir it. And it again. Put it back in the microwave for another two minutes. Alright, so last and final pour right here. If you don't think you've got enough, you can always add more wax, which I think I may add a little bit more. Alright, so I've added a little bit more wax into it and filled it the rest of the way up. So, there you go. Um, a new trick that I just learned not too long ago is if you actually stick the liquid in the refrigerator for a little bit, it will help it solidify faster. Just be careful if you're adding more um, hot wax to it because, of course, if um, cool accidentally hits hot at a rapid pace, it could cause the glass to shatter. So just be careful. Um, once that solidifies, you will have a nice, pretty candle like this one. This one was actually scented with lavender and is going to a really good friend of mine but please keep in mind um, if you want to place an order with me uh, for a different kind a different scent i can do just about anything candle melts regular candles small candles um, just let me know if you're interested prices range based on size um, scent if you want anything um, painted on the glass um, any initial or anything like that just let me know